Hello Capricorn and welcome to your November general reading. This is going to be a reading for anyone who has a placement in the sign of Capricorn, such as Ascendant, Sun or Moon, and it's for the time period of November 2022. In this reading I'm going to be looking at the most predominant energies that Capricorn might find themselves influenced by in the period of November 2022. After this reading I'm gonna be pulling few cards to check how these energies might prolong their influence for Capricorn in December and in the months to come. So let's have a look at the most important energies for Capricorn in the period of November 2022. By the way, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please do so. In this way, you will never miss an upload, Capricorn. So let's see what is going on for you in the month of November. You have Eight of Swords as a general energy of your reading. Ace of Pentacle, Seven of Swords, and Nine of Pentacles. Bottom of the deck, right here and right now, is the Star. Capricorn, looking in your cards, I have a question for you. Have you forgotten that you are the star the star in your own story, Capricorn? The star energy right here and now, it's talking to me that Capricorn might need some time to heal from any previous disappointments, from any impact of illusion, scarcity, or anything negative that might be crossing your mind right here and right now. And I'm saying this because the overall energy of the period of November for Capricorn is under the influence of Eight of Swords. You not being able to really see to really understand what bothers you, what is keeping you stuck. And it, by, it might be just mental stagnation, but it also might be a lack of crucial information to do with really lighting up your path, Capricorn. You might be missing something that it's important to you to believe that you are the star in your own journey and not that Capricorn um, trusts in their luck so much but you have also the luck to do with moving on even not being exactly clear of how and let's see what else is happening for Capricorn in November. There is a brand new start opening for you in this time period, a brand new project. Some of you Capricorns might receive unexpected sum of money or financial support that wasn't available for you earlier. And one way or another, it's a brand new beginning. It's a brand new beginning and at the same time there is still negativity to do with your own value, if you like. It's the energy of self-sabotage, this card, to me, presented in the center of your reading. And you Capricorn... I'm not a person that it's afraid, but sometimes you let negative thoughts or lack of clarity 
presented in the energy of the period to work against you to let you trick yourself with your own ideas with your own thoughts and it's a really blocking energy that you need to be aware from aware for because with this new beginning you really have the chance the opportunity to succeed and get much desired financial security prosperity and a good living if you like this is a lot of positive developments available for you in the month of november and somehow you capricorn don't trust it don't believe it or you lack the needed information and this is when you really need to remind yourself that you have the start the star quality needed for any successful development that you would like to approach to begin fresh to establish because this is a brand new material beginning no time for sabotage capricorn or self-sabotage for some other of you might be a person that is really misleading you and it's in the center of this new success story that you might try to achieve if it's not you then think about someone that it's really shaping the truth in a way that you miss important details important information about what needs to be done let's check these seven of swords and eight of swords energies for capricorn in their november reading why are they here we have the magician confirming seven of swords and we have page of wands confirming eight of swords when it comes to self-doubt and self-sabotaging capricorn you need to know like always you're the star you need to remember that you have everything you need it's like constant understanding about that can prevent you from going against you or you need to believe that you are the master and there is no time for you doubting it you have everything you need capricorn to start fresh always start fresh with this energy if this is someone working against you though this is someone capable of, of really getting on your way that's another thing you need to remember if this is not your own self-sabotaging belief system on the way standing on the way in this fabulous development and also when you find yourself paralyzed in your own head constantly thinking over going through things situations uncertainty and clarity remember the fire that you carry inside of you your inner child your inner strength if you like your youthful approach to things and the belief that comes with it that you are always capable you are always powerful enough to go through any unclear uncertain situation or for some of you in it might be in this period you receive a proof exactly for this let's see more for capricorn in november 
and what else we can find out for this situation that Capricorn might be in this time period so eight of swords is confirmed by page of swords ace of pentacles confirmed by queen of pentacles seven of swords confirmed by seven of cups and six of swords confirming nine of pentacles and the bottom of the deck two of pentacles you're going to succeed balancing any unclear uncertain situation and you're going to be managing to successfully operate under pressure if you like but not only that you're going to receive success and the needed confirmation for your star, star qualities in this brand new endeavor capricorn and believe it or not even through uncertainty you are still going to be able to attract the right situation the right people the right conditions in order for you to have a successful well thought of well taken care of brand new material beginning i see this as a new job or a new professional project and you might be pushed in a way to balance this new development with something that you already have on the table but still you are going to be successful with it the queen of pentacles is also the energy of someone that although being ambitious chasing and uh, producing the outcome that they desire they still manage to take care of the people around them in a very calm and satisfying manner so this is you and seven of cups on top of seven of swords you are going to be making a choice capricorn and you might be choosing between you being fearful and uncertain or you being always and forever the master of your own destiny although you might lack some information but still use your heart when you make this choice because it's important for you it's right in the center of your reading which means that choices in the period of november need to be love based not fear based capricorn you choose what is best for you trusting in your heart that you not only deserve it but you also are capable of working for it establishing it having everything necessary for your goal for your choice to be the best one and I really see you managing to see through all the uncertainty and temper yourself lower the stress and really approach this more stable this more secure this situation in which you really benefit from your own efforts and enjoying it also the information that you might need this breakthrough it's on its way capricorn so really 
temper down your negative thoughts, cool down because a new information, new idea, news to do with this unclarity that you might have in this period is actually going to be solved with this new information, with this new concept, if you like. And it's bringing the needed potential in order for you to really move successfully into this new material beginning. A project, a new business, whatever it might be for you, Capricorn. Really, it's not time for you to doubt yourself because the outcome is really good. And let's check this Two of Pentacles. Confirm it with another card just to make sure. Yes, <laughs> it's going to be the end of a painful cycle. This new development is actually gonna It's going to make you cut the negative thought patterns, disappointments, betrayals, everything that is stagnating you and preventing you from working towards your best interest, Capricorn. Let's see now how these energies might prolong for the end of November for Capricorn and the months to come, December, January, so on. Let's see gonna be pulling one major arcana and then confirm it with go, I'm gonna confirm it with three new cards you have the hermit energy and then the hermit is going to be confirmed with another set of three cards And these are going to be one, two, three. So Capricorn, let's go back to the Hermit energy. I'm going to look at these cards later on. End of November, beginning of December, it's actually when the sun is still in Scorpio and in Sagittarius towards the end of November actually the sun is going to be to the most far away point for you Capricorn before it enters the sign of Capricorn so it's the, the dark night of the soul if you like but in this period you actually one way or another going to use the time in solitude to go back in your eternal world and check what is your ability, what is your potential, what is that you desire the most, but on more eternal level, eternal level than on the external. And you're gonna find what makes you really the leader of your own destiny. And then the cards after that really do confirm that as well you, you have eight of wands eight of swords and princess of swords which in this case it's the page of swords so this is double confirmed you're in a period in which you might be really open to any new idea any new concept or vision that you might implement into your existing plan or to do with this new material beginning that you are trying to establish in November and through December. This is a card that uh, it's talking about a new lifestyle, a new uh, image for you in the world and although the energy from Eight of Swords might prolong its existence. Actually, it's not going to stop you from moving forwards. Do the necessary networking 
and really be successful in communication about what you want to achieve. Like you're going to find the needed inspiration and energy and it's going to be on a very eternal level that it might come from to really continue su successfully fight for the best outcome in your professional life to do with any existing project situations and also to do with this new material beginning that is really going to be on the radar for you in November Capricorn and it's going to continue to be on your radar in the months to come. This is all I have for you Capricorn. I really hope you believe in yourself completely and don't let any self-sabotaging thoughts, ideas or lack of information prevent you from being the master of your own destiny. Take care and I'm gonna see you in December for your general December reading Capricorn. Take care.